What is up guys? This is Vomin episode number 15, baby. Okay, so I got a couple things going, man. First, it's just me. It's just me. Next couple of videos, next farming views could be a ton of people actually because we're going to have a big harvest day to kind of finish off the harvest section and then we're going to get into livestock and stuff. But right now, we got to wash these tractors. Not right now, I should say. During this video, we got to wash the tractors and we got to wash the combines. It's gonna, we're gonna finish off the video by washing all the stuff, but right now I'm just finishing up millet a little bit. Got this combine, got the John Deere combine. It's almost full, let me tap around to this thing. And then I'm gonna lease two other semis, I'm thinking. Okay, yeah, this guy can keep going, man. You can keep going, man, you're on the roll. Um, should I, okay, I can't lease the semis now. I gotta get the candy, I gotta get the 4840. Where's the 4840? Come on. There we go, okay, 4845, this baby up. I'm gonna wait this time. I'm gonna wait until it's full. Or I'm gonna wait until it's started. Okay, hold up, hold up. There we are we good? Are we good to go? Come on, we gotta let it go. Come on. Okay, we're going. Now you can hear it go. Check it, check it, dude. I love this view too, this cab view. The cab is sweet and everything. I wonder if that you guys see that scale on the back of the Kinsey? I wonder if it works, dude. And also guys, if you guys are enjoying the series, let me know by now like button, dude. And, okay, so we gotta go, let's go to the, actually, you know what, let's unload this guy on the go, let's see if we can get him to not stop. I think, I don't know, man, I don't know if we're gonna make it, don't stop, dude, don't stop, I think he's gonna be full. Come on, come on, come on, can the squad make it, I'm here, dude, I'm here, what do you need? Don't, there we go, unload, unload, come on, I'm here. There we go, sweet, we made it, we made it, I, I, I bet we were so close, I wanna, I honestly wanna hop out of the combine just to see, I'll hop out of the tractor just to see where it's at. I should set it at 6 miles an hour because I think they go 6 miles an hour, but I think I should be able to control it from here. Oh boy, speed up. Oh yeah, the scale actually works on there. That's cool too. Yeah, I should, I should be good from here. Okay, we'll just keep going alongside here. Oh boy, hopefully we don't get in its way too. There we go. Oh, we got to go to the right a little bit. Sweet, we should be good. And you can always tell if it's dropping right in the middle of this triangle, my little window, we're on point. We're perfect. See? There we go. Okay, I was going a little slow there. If we just can hold six mile an hour, I think we should be just about full. We should be just about good, and then we gotta hop over. There we go. We're good. Okay, we're pulling away. Oh boy. Okay, we don't. We can't turn too tight because it just gets caught back there on the 4840. 4840 is gonna be the guys. Whether you like it or not, the 4840 is gonna be the grain car tractor. I'm thinking. We're gonna keep it old school. Maybe, maybe we'll get a newer tractor. But I like this big 4840. A lot of horsepower. Old school on the grain car even though you know you don't probably see it in today's in today's world especially when guys have all new equipment and then they have like one old tractor on the grain car you don't really see that that often uh, especially when they have all new equipment um so we gotta go over to that case dude we're barely making it up the hill right now too oh there we go we'll just go right over the straw line there we go is, is millet yeah this would be called straw too i don't know if we'll get to bailing this but i gotta i'm gonna lease i got the following mod too we're gonna lease two other semis and try to take them, and try to take them into town too, and try to haul grain into town if we can release them because our storage is full right now. Our full, our storage is completely full, and actually we have an extra like silo that I bought off camera, which I couldn't get working, so I'm just gonna sell it. But so yeah, we gotta buy this other. So there's a silo right next to our storage unit that I'm not using, so we can sell this thing and have some money wherever it is. There we go, 35 grand. It's not empty. The following grain types will be sold. Oh, it's... Oh, it's full. We had it full already. Okay, so... Oh, dude, can I get out of this? No, I, I don't want to sell them. Can I get out of it? Come on, man. I can't even get out of it. Okay, I guess we're just going to have to sell it. So, I guess it was full. Okay, so we'll sell them for 20 grand. We'll sell grain for 20 grand and then get... So, we should get like 50... Okay. No. Okay, there. We kept it. We kept it. So, I gotta go... Okay, so, what I did is I just... Here, I'll, I'll tab over, actually. I just placed it... Oh, okay, see it? See it? There's a small silo. I just placed it right next to these grain bins, and it just added on storage to these grain bins and stuff. So, it actually worked out pretty good, and actually, there's millet in there right now, and it's full. Everything's full here. So, we'll keep that, and then... Okay, this is good to go. We'll get going here with the case, and then, dude, it's time to lease... I think I'm going to get max this time. We have a Peterbilt. 
I think I'm going to go with two max this time. We're going to lease them. Lease both of them. Oh, dude, the lease isn't even that bad. That's not bad at all. Okay, um, we'll go 605 horsepower. We'll, oh, dude. Okay, we'll go. Should we go all black? Because the Peterbilt's black, right? We'll go all black. We'll go black. Um, okay, we don't even need this stuff. Lease it. I think hopefully black looks cool. Oh, oh, dude. Oh, good thing I didn't buy it because I was so close to buying it. We'll lease another one. We're going to lease two, and then we're going to lease two Wilsons. And we are going to be trucking so much grain. It's a good thing we got the follow me mod, man. It's a good thing. Where's this thing at? There we go. Lease two of these. Lease cost isn't bad. I'm, I am got to remember to get rid of them because sometimes I forget that I'm leasing stuff. So you guys got to remind me. Um, we got the 4840 here. Okay, let's go grab those things. We got the follow me mod. Oh, dude, shoot. How does the follow me mod work again? Oh, how does the follow me mod work again? Okay, I think I can figure it out. Let me just, like, pull behind this thing. Okay, I'll, I should be able to figure it out. I think it's right shift F, I think. Oh, I gotta figure this. Oh, dude, I should have I should have looked. Should be right shift F. Okay, here. We'll stop. Okay, we'll get this one pulled out here. There we go. We got a Mac. And then we got to get one more lined up. And, dude, we're going to be trucking so much. I don't even know if we need three of these. But we got one. Yeah. No, we'll need all three. Yeah, we'll definitely need all three of these. Dude, I'm curious to see how much money we're going to get, though, selling all this grain. Because we've got a lot of millet in storage. And we've got some that we're taking out of the field right now, of course. Okay. I think I can get it. I think I can get it. It's right can right shift F. No. Is it right? Ah, oh, what is it? Right shift. Oh, S. Right shift W. Oh wait. Oh boy. What are we doing? I thought it was right shift. Oh, right control. Right control F. There we go. We got it. Hey, we got it. Okay, now right control. W? Okay, that's going to fall really close behind, but... Okay, now we probably want 20 me Uh, right control S. There we go. Okay, 20 should be good. Hopefully 20 is good. We're going to get rolling, boys. We're going to head back. I figured this out. Sweet. It should fall behind all good. I'm thinking. There we go. And that guy's going to keep coming behind. Hopefully he doesn't, like, come flying crashing into us. I wonder what happens if I break. He's close to running into us, but he stops. He stops. Okay. There we go. We should be good. Oh, boy. Oh, gosh, dude. Is he going to hit that? I wonder if he's going to hit that. Oh, dude. He, he hit it. But, or he he barely missed it, just like I did. Okay, sweet. Um, help her. Oh, dude. Is he going to get stuck on the tracks? Oh, dude. What, what are you doing, dude? Oh, my gosh. He's going everywhere. Come on. Stay straight. Come on, dude. Oh, he's stuck on the pole. Okay, little buddy. We're going to come get you. Oh, dude. What are you... He's just going everywhere. Okay, maybe maybe it's my, I gotta drive it a little better too. Oh, okay. Um, gotta take him off of this, and then we gotta go follow behind. And then actually, what we got? Okay, there we go. Um, what we actually gotta do is one is full. Oh, the John Deere's full already. Oh, dude, we're almost done with this. Sweet, this is gonna all work out good, I think. Actually, you know what? Are they, were they actually full? Okay, this is almost full. Honestly, we're just going to let him go. Yeah, we'll just let him go for now. Okay. Sorry about all the tapping, guys. Hopefully, this boy, this guy's still following, I'm thinking. Okay, yeah. There we go. We should be good. Okay, it's me steering right and left all the time. I think it's throwing him off a little bit when I, when I steer all over the place. Okay, there he goes. He's following good now. I, I just got to take it easy. I just got to take it slow. Yeah, there we go. He's falling good now. I don't like it. Sweet. Okay, now he's falling good. Oh, I forgot you can't do first person. It kind of sucks doing first person. There we go. He's doing good. Okay, let's see. Let's ramp up the speed a little bit. Let's see how he does now. Let's we really get going. Oh, he's doing decent. Okay, hopefully he doesn't go flipping. I probably should slow her down a little bit. Yeah, we can get... Dude, we can get rolling. This is going to be cool. We can get rolling up and down here. Okay, ooh! Oh my gosh! Did you guys just see that? Oh my gosh, I just looked back. And he went flying up the ditch and just jumped the road. 
Dude, bro, what is this guy doing? Where's he at? He's probably just stuck in a tree up here. Oh my gosh, dude. Okay. Oh, dude, where does he go? I saw him. Co oh, okay, look, here's the tracks. Where, Where is he at? Where is he at? Okay, here's the tracks. He went flying down here, came up here. Here's the tra Okay, it's like a little trail. We got to follow this dude. Okay, sorry about the unrealistic gu style, guys, but he's go is he going to be in here somewhere? Okay, let's just look on our map. Oh, he's down here. Okay, he's down here. Somewhere down here, I guess. Where's he at? Oh, holy crap, dude. Look at this, dude. I said, I knew I saw him. Okay, dude. No, you're, got, you're done. You're done, dude. You're good. You don't have to climb the tree. You don't have to go. Oh, my gosh. Okay. I can do it, but I have to go slow. Because if I get going too fast, this dude wants to go screaming, flying up hills and stuff. I need to put that on replay because that was insane. Oh my gosh. Okay. Holy crap. I don't know if it's a trailer like throwing him around or what. what is it? I have no idea. Okay. What we'll do is we'll put it on. Nope. You're going to follow the leader. Okay. You're going to follow the leader by 40. Will that improve it? Hopefully. Hopefully they'll improve it. I think I can only go like 30 miles an hour because did you guys see that guy? Okay, dude. You should probably be going by now. There we go. Okay, hopefully he does better. I'm thinking he'll do better. Yeah, I looked back in the corner of my eye. just saw him go insane all over the road. Okay. Oh, dude, keep it together. Keep it together. What is he doing? Shoot. Should I sell him? Should I sell the lease? And only have... Dude, this sucks. I was playing transport the grain. Okay, maybe I'm going to have to wait until we get a lot of people. Because this, this will not work. Okay, I, I'm going to get rid of the lease on both of these guys right... Oh. Yeah, I think i got to get rid of the lease on both of these right now is what we'll do. Or maybe we'll keep one of them. We'll, we might as well just keep one of them. But let me get rid of lease on... Uh, where are we at? Garage. Leased items. Okay, we'll sell one of these. Hopefully, I sell, like... Okay, this is locked. Let's see. Hopefully, I get both of them. Okay, we returned them. That was kind of a waste of money, but... Okay, there we go. Sweet. We so Okay, that worked out good. We got this guy. Okay, this is the one we're leaving. Yeah, that follow me. Gosh, I thought it was going to work a lot better. I don't know why. He just went flying over the road. So right now we'll have two semis. I don't even, I don't think I'll, I'll get him loaded, but I won't get him transported to the elevator yet. So we can go flying with this, dude. We're, we're good. We'll put the tarp back on. And then helper H was full down there, but it doesn't matter. I don't have to tab over there because we're pretty much done with that field. There might be one more strip I got to get yet. Yeah, dude, that was extremely weird. Okay, we'll drive on that. I noticed a lot of people commented that I like drive a little crazy, so we'll we'll drive good this time. We'll stay on the right side of the road. Road, hopefully. Okay, I better sl if I want to drive realistically, I gotta slow down here. There we go, dude. That noise, the Jake brake is insanely loud on this truck. There we go, and we'll fly down here, and then we gotta honestly, we'll pull into the field probably, and just start loading in the field. I don't think I'll. Yeah, we'll just start loading in the field quick. We already have a semi that's basically full. And then after, if we don't get both these semis full, full, full I should say, we'll have 150,000 liters in grain storage still that I got to go sell. So we'll probably do it at a video where I get tons of people on this map. Because right now, I'm to the point, man, where I need, like, help. I need a lot of workers. And so, okay, we'll pull into the field here. Parked by this dude. And, yeah, he's not even full all the way, too. Oh, oh actually, are we going to have enough room? I better move a little bit. I better put a little gap in between us so we have enough room for the grain cart. There we go. Okay, we should be good. Okay, we got to grab the grain cart, actually. Where's the 4840? I should be... Honestly, you guys, I should... Oh, dude, luck. Who's going to get it? Who's going to finish it? There's two guys out there. 4840 is here. We'll just let the John Deere finish her off. Okay, we're just going to go. Honestly, I should probably turn on automatic start because this is going to get really annoying just waiting for it to 
start up and stuff. So, I, guys, I probably should. I probably will. But then I always forget. Here, honestly, I'll just do it right now. Oh, boy. We're shaking. We're shaking. This is really weird. It's like, okay, we should be good, though. Okay. Start unloading. And then we'll grab the case. And we'll just bring the case back. This is completely full. Honestly, we can just drive it back over to the semi because we'll be done with this. We'll let the John Deere finish it off. Nothing against, like, not case or John Deere, guys. We're just letting the John Deere finish it off. <laughs> okay, and we'll keep going down here. Yeah, we'll just unload it in the semi way, way down here. And then I got, dude, I got to wash all this stuff up. I really got to wash all this stuff up, and we should be good. I got to put it away. And honestly, is it, so the case is dirty. I'm curious to see if this John Deere is dirty, though. If it's dirty at all, right? Is the John Deere dirty? It doesn't even look dirty at all. Okay, so I don't even think the John Deere gets dirty. So we don't even need to wash it. We'll only wash the case. 4840 is not really dirty. Maybe the Kinsey. The Kinsey is a little tad dirty. It doesn't really need to wash. The two planter tractors really need to wash, though. And the case. So we'll finish off washing those, and then, yeah, I'll just start unloading into, probably just unload into one of these, and then, honestly, I can probably take the combine back. We just gotta get all of this equipment taken back right now. Can I cut through there? Oh, I can't cut down through the pasture. Doesn't look like. So we'll, f okay, yeah, what we'll do is we'll fill, we'll fill this, Oh, dude, am I going to have enough room? Okay, what we'll have to do is we'll have to pull around here. We'll fill this semi, get it full, and then, honestly, we're probably going to have to just load grain with the trucks, and we'll get them ready. We'll get them ready for next video. Oh, come on. Oh, okay, I got to move the I gotta move the semi a little bit. Yep, and we got to hit enter to start it, because I always forget to start it. Helper A has completed their task. Sweet. Okay, we'll get we'll tab over, grab helper A. We're good. And we'll just drive this back and then we gotta get the the grain cart must be full. I bet it's I bet yeah, it's gotta be full. So we're done with millet. We're pretty much done with millet. There's a couple fields we could actually harvest, but I'm saying I'm calling it. We're calling her good. We just gotta sell all the grain now, get the money, and then we're gonna do one big corn harvest and then move on to cows. Seems like a plan. Okay. Hopefully, I, this has gotta be full. I'm just curious to see if it is. Yep, she's full. She is full, and then we'll unload into this semi over here again. If it's not full, if not, we'll just unload in the other semi. We'll take both of these back, and then we're gonna help have to hold this head with uh, the trailer and the Chevy back. Oh boy, there's a lot to do yet. So we'll fill these, and maybe, maybe, maybe we'll just take the case and just head take it back and just wash it all up, and then I'll get this stuff later. I don't know yet. I would like to get these semis full, everything put away, but that's gonna take forever to get it all done. And. Semi's not full yet. It's not all the way full. Oh, is this going to work out? Oh, nope, it's not going to work out. Actually, I might as well just drop the head right now since we got the trailer here. Hopefully, I put it on the... Yeah, I think I'll put it on the wrong right way. It's kind of weird. This... I'm not... Oh, we got to turn it on. That's right. This trailer's kind of weird. I got to get this trailer figured out. Okay, we'll pull the Duramax up a little bit. And then... Get in the combine drop it on the trailer I don't know if it like locks on the trailer or what but Sam actually got this loaded I wasn't the one that got loaded okay I gotta get over just a tad bit I think but he just dropped it on there thinking we'll be good okay let's see if we can like lock it It stays pretty good. That's what's weird. It's like locked. It's locked on there pretty good. Okay, we should be good. You would think you'd have to lock it. Maybe it automatically goes and stuff. 
Okay, we should be good, and then we'll put the John Deere away too. We'll just make the turn quick. That's good. I like it. Yeah, it doesn't even slide off really. Or it's tough to get to slide off. Um, oh boy, we got a lot of trailers here too. Oh, we held the combine here. That's right. And then we got to unload the combine. We'll shed the combine. We don't really need to wash it. I'm not. I don't think. And then what we'll do is we'll grab the 4840, start her up, and then we'll get the, we'll empty it all into the semi, what's all in the grain cart into the semi, and then that'll be empty. And then we just got to finish it. We just got to wash all the tractors. We're going to get all the trash, tractors wash, washed. I'm kind of excited to wash all the tractors, to be honest with you. It'd be cool if the tractors ran on a, ga a diesel, I should say, a little faster. That way we actually have to refill them, like, you know, bring the bring the gas cart into the field and stuff like that the gas trailer into the field and stuff that'd be that'd be pretty cool if we actually had to do that a little more often i'm sure maybe i could change the setting to do that a little more often i'm excited to sell all this millet though millet millet what's the other term for it is it oh what is it gosh why can't i think of it it starts with an m too and i've heard it so many times i don't know why i can't think of it oh yeah the green card does kind of need wash a little bit Okay, that's basically full, it looks like. We'll just unload the rest of this into uh, this truck. If we can get around. Come on. There we go, sweet. It's going to be a while until that, that dude gets all unloaded. Is the John Deere finished, though? John Deere's finished. Okay, we'll take it back. We actually go pretty fast. 19 mile an hour is pretty good. We'll just shed it. Um, I'm trying to think what shed we'll put it in. Honestly, we'll probably just put it in the shed, like right here to our right. We can't get in there. We got to drive all the way around this fence and then come through there. So it'll be a bit too bad. There's not just an entrance right here, is there? I don't think there is. Wait, it, nah, dude, that'd be sweet if there's just a gate right there. Actually, we got to fix those wagons too. They're kind of like all over the place. We got to drive all the way up here, and then we got to cut back through our farm to shed it. But this is pretty cool what we got going. I gotta, oh dude, yeah, yeah, I was gonna say we gotta wash this stuff too. Oh, hopefully we're gonna be able to get around here. We should be able to. It's kind of dirty. Look in the window though. Look in the window. There is a little dirt. She needs washed. We're gonna wash her. We're gonna get her washed. It's just barely dirty. Um, It, it just probably doesn't get as dirty as... Can we go? Oh, that's right. We gotta start her up. And then... We could probably just, yeah, we can pull this this uh, head back, too, I guess. There we go. It should pull down. Drop it. And we should be able to attach to it. It's kind of nice that you can just pull this back. It's a lot better than John Deere. Actually, how it has its, like, own trailer. Is that actually how it is in real life? Where, it, where you can actually hydraulically, like, fold out the trailer, guys? I've never seen that, but I'm, I bet it is. Especially if it's in the game. Okay, and we'll roll on over, get the combine washed up, get combine two tractors washed up. Oh, for a second I looked over there and I was like, dude, did we just spill grain on the ground? Stuff Is the 4840 still loaded? Okay, no, nah, it's, it's done. We gotta shut all that. The Kinsey's kind of dirty, we'll get it washed later. I just want to get this main equipment washed right now. And we also have another harvest coming up, so I don't even know why I'm washing it. But uh, it'd be kind of cool to finish out the video just washing all this stuff up, I feel like. And we'll keep going down the field. The John Deere went 19 mile an hour. The case only goes 16 mile an hour. Just pull her up. Okay, so, ooh, what do we got to wash first? What do we have to wash first? We got to wash. Okay, we'll just wash. We'll just go in the line. We'll just go in the line. Unfortunately, we're gonna have to move out all the equipment like all the time as we're washing it, which is kind of gonna suck. Better save the game too while we're here. And okay, so first things first, we'll wash the magnum. We'll wash the magnum all up. Um, where's my power washer at? Sweet. The planters don't even need washed. The dirty magnum, dude. There we go. Come on, keep washing her. And then I'll shed the equipment later. I just want to get this all washed for now. The planter's good. Planter's clean. We're almost clean. Are we good? We good? We good? Um, we're good. Sweet. We're going to the John Deere. Our hose probably can't extend this far. I wonder if we can reach from here. But anyways, because the John Deere done. 7210. Can I put front duels on the 7210? That'd be kind of cool if I could. 
I'd, I'd be curious to see what it looks like on the 1710. I don't think you can. I think it's only the 8R series that you probably could. Maybe, I guess. Okay, that's probably good. Pla I know we. I know we, the planter's good. What we'll do is we'll pull these out. Maybe we'll just park these. I don't even know if I have room to park these. Actually, yeah, dude, I don't even know. I don't even know if I'm gonna have room. Who knows? Okay. Uh. Oh boy. Are we gonna be able to make this in here? Okay, we gotta move around the gas barrel. It's gonna be tight. It is gonna be tight getting in here. Oh, we can't make the turn. I can't turn that tight. It doesn't love me to turn that tight. Come on. The, oh, so close. There we go. Now we gotta swing wide. Dude, it's so. Okay, we're not even gonna put these in here because it's gonna be. I know it's gonna be so tough to just get them in there. It's always annoying. Okay, we're gonna hit the shed. And we're gonna pull forward. Okay, what we'll do is we'll just back them in here for now. We'll probably just. I guess we're just gonna have to leave them outside for now. I'll just back it up in here. We should be good just backing it up in here. Then we gotta wash the. Yeah, because we're right now we're not even using these sheds in the dairy farm. Uh, okay, so we got to wash. John Deere's pretty clean. Might as well just pull it back there. It's fired up. 7R, baby. Dude, the 7R is a sweet tractor. You guys got to admit, 7, 7R, I like, I like the 7R. It's pretty good. It's a pretty cool tractor, I'm thinking. What we'll do is we'll pull around. Oh, pull this way, and then we'll back up that way. We should be good as long as we don't go in the fence. And we'll just back up right along the magnum. Ooh, are we going to be able to fit through there? Or should... Ah, yeah, we'll be able to fit. Hopefully. Hopefully we'll be able to fit. Yeah, we should be good. Come on. There we go. Okay, I, was, I, was, I wasn't sure if we were going to hit that tire of the magnum or not. Oh, dude, are we going to hit the other planter, though? Okay, we should be good. Then, oh, I guess I'm leaving all... Oh, dude, you know what's happening right now? I'm leaving all the tractors and everything running because we have the unmaxed start off. Start on, I guess. Okay, oh, I forgot we had that header on there. We'll get the case washed up. Sweet. There we go. Honestly, is it good? The header, the header, header's a little dirty, see? You got a little dirt there. Clear the dirt off, but the case looks pretty much clean right now. Look at her. Sweet, case is good. Case is good to go. Let's move it out of the way. I'm not sure what shed I'm going to put in. Probably the shed way up there. For now, I'll just move it out of the way so we can get the John Deere in here. And to get the John Deere, it's barely, just barely dirty. If you just look at the window, that's like about it. Oh, did we shut the, we must have shut the John Deere off. Yeah, it's just the windows and stuff. This should clean up like really fast. Oh, dude, I didn't even know that moves. Look at it. It moves actually. That's sweet how it moves. I love it. And we'll hop out. Turn the power washer on. Finish her off. Harvest. Millet harvest, I should say. It's completely done. We should get all the dirt off. It wasn't dirty at all. Got all the dirt off, guys. Millet harvest is completely done. This is going to be the end of the video. Hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, go and hit that like button. Hey, I'll see you guys later for episode number 16. Thanks for watching, guys.